fuck you mom ah there you are butthole all right let's get to work what have you found super craig kimmy's phone has a bunch of notes in it something about a girl who has information about all the criminal activity in town what girl it just says find the girl with the dick tattoo what girl in town has a dick tattoo? I don't know, Mosquito, but the Freedom Pals must think she's the key to finding the missing cat. If the Freedom Pals find her before we do, they'll get the $100 reward. We cannot let that happen. We have to stop the Freedom Pals from having a sweet franchise at all costs. Then we have to find the girl with that tattoo tonight. Fast Pass is right. We all have to sneak out of our houses tonight and search the entire town. What do you say, new kid? Are you up for it? If you want to be a coon friend, you have to learn to communicate. Yeah, who let this guy join us anyway? Go easy on him, you guys. He's had a tough life. When he was six years old, his dad fucked his mom. What? I'm sorry, friend, but it's time they learned your tragic backstory. Butthole doesn't trust anyone because his dad fucked his mom and he couldn't do anything to stop it. That doesn't make any sense. I know. How could the person you trust do that to the only other person you love? Carmen, everyone's dad fucked everyone's mom. Huh? That's how it works, stupid. Our dads fucked our moms. Oh, right. So does that mean your dad fucked your mom, Cam? Huh? Yes! My dad fucked my mom! That's why I'm here! Don't steal his backstory, dude. That's not cool. You're so fucking stupid! Every human alive on Earth had a dad who fucked their mom stop, and- Stop, stop! This is not what's important right now! We need to find the lady with the dick tattoo! Yeah, let's get home so we can prepare for evening missions. Let's go, coon friends! He's such a fucking idiot! It's okay, calm down. I'm afraid you'll have to deal with that kind of bigotry your whole life, butthole. When people don't understand, they lash out. I'm going to let you be a sidekick tonight to one of the coon friends. Go home and sneak out after your parents are asleep. I'll fill you in later. Doing even talking to the school counselor. Why'd you answer the phone? Have you lost your fucking mind? Our child felt the need to go talk to the school counselor. Doesn't that bother you at all? So you told him the truth? No, we didn't talk about that at all. You dumb bitch! You'll ruin everything! I don't have to listen to this from a stoned out pothead! I need a drink. Sure, drown your problems in Chardonnay, you stupid skank! Oh, hey, whippersnapper! Have a fun day out playing? <laughs> well, I'm exhausted. Gonna get ready for bed. Dinner's on the table if you want it, punk. But then straight to bed, okay? Pothead. Alcoholic.
Sweetie, I just want you to know that whatever happens, Mommy always loved you. Good night, sweetheart. That time, that's when the creeps come out. But unfortunately for the creeps, the other thing that comes out at night is a key. Let's just stay in tonight. Don't forget you can use your snapping pops to knock things down. See ya, bud. No! Stay out! school student, but then one day, a freak science accident turned my diabetes into superhuman strength. All right, sidekick, we're supposed to go investigate a girl who might know the location of the missing cat. Follow me. Ready? Let's go, sidekick. Kyle's this way. Fuck it, bitch! Let's see how you like this! I am Captain Diabetes, and this is my faithful sidekick! Oh, okay. Well, move out of the way, huh? I need to go buy some more beer. I'm sorry, but Captain Diabetes cannot let you drive! I'm fine to drive, okay? Get out of here! Hey, give me my keys! You are in no condition, sir! I'm fine, okay? Look, wait, look, look! I'm fine, okay? Give me my keys. I'll return them tomorrow. Give me my fucking keys, you little shit! You think I can dance with this? Let's go! Stop him, sidekick! Let, let me just take a breather here. Try to gather myself. What, what was I, uh, what was... Oh, yeah! My motherfucking keys! Ah! <laughs> hey, I almost spilled my drink! Now I got a shield that will absorb damage! Okay, I don't usually beat up kids, but I'm kind of getting into it. Give me my fucking keys! Attack! Uh, take it easy, you shit! 
You're no match for Captain Diabetes and his crusty sidekicks. Uh, I need a pick me up. Give me my goddamn keys. I'm afraid that's impossible. You can't stand up to my crusty sidekick. Anymore. What do you say you just give me those? Okay. There. I'm fine to drive. I'm fine. Okay, okay. Okay, now I'm fine. You should be fine to drive at approximately 11 a.m. tomorrow. It's 11 a.m. somewhere. You really need to sign up for AA, Mr. Mark. Let's do this diabetes and whatever the fuck the other. I can't believe I did that without falling. Tell them what you're made of, sad kick. Physical damage, my favorite. Stand back, sad kick. I'll take care of this. Hey, what'd I do? We can all go to the store together. You, you drive. I will not break the law, sir. Okay then. I wasn't good to drive before, but now I am. Thanks for, thanks for having my back. Now let me have my key. I'm sorry, but I stand by my previous assessment of your fitness to operate machinery. Fuck. Pick up some feminine products. So, whoa, 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 how'd I end up over here? Take them down, sidekicks. I'll hold him off, sidekick. I can take it. Hey, I think I dropped my keys. Anyone seen them? I have confiscated them. Keys right after this short little nap. Good night, Mr. Marsh. There's a shortcut through human kite space. Kyle's off on another mission right now. We're on our own.
the shortcuts up there in the attic. The coon gave us permission to use it. Sometimes, when I have too much sugar, I get really angry and strong. I call it my diabetic rage. It's kind of like when Wolverine took that green stuff at the end of Logan. Yeah. That's one second. This is Humankind's secret base. Farts make me angry. The coon says it's because my mom farted when she gave birth to me, and that's why I have diabetes. I don't think that's why I have diabetes, though. I think it was a gift to help fight crime. The shortcut is through that window. I don't have my own secret base, but if I did, at least I'll clean it up. Well done, sidekick! This shortcut will take us right into the heart of downtown South Park. Come on, sidekick. Do not be afraid. I don't think people get diabetes because their mom started doing childbirth, do you? I, I feel like Coon made that up to make Captain Diabetes feel insecure about himself. As you can see, Sidekick, at nighttime, South Park is quite a different place. We've got to get into the Peppermint Hippo, to the town square! <laughs> and over only. Stand aside, citizen. It is I, Captain Diabetes. I must speak with the ladies inside. Get out of here before I fucking throw you out. What to do? Hey, will you kids get out of here already? Talk, take it the fuck outside. I told you to get out of here. Hmm. There must be another way in somewhere. Look at this sidekick. A way in. Great detective work, sidekick. Now we just need a way up there. Find your way in. Oh, of course! Stand aside, sidekick! 
boy. Kid. You remind me of a young me. Take the one with the speech impediment. Come on, get some dances. I was thinking we could just go in there and talk for a little while. Yeah, first we get dances, then we talk. Oh, okay. So, have you gentlemen ever had dances from a girl with a penis tattoo? Hey, we didn't come back here to talk, baby. Yeah, no talking until you finish grinding on our chugs. Oh, all right. Okay, sidekick, you know what this means. I'm not gonna pay for this. Oh, right. Good. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. Jesus, baby, you're sticking up the VIP room. What kind of move was that? Come on. Oh, come on, you're killing my buzz here. Taking up the VIP room. What the fuck? Oh no, stop. Let's just talk. Let's 
Let's just talk. Okay, chat time. Chat time? Aw, oh, man. So, what kind of work do you guys do? And have you ever danced with a girl here who has a penis tattoo? Why do you keep talking about a stripper with a penis tattoo? Yeah, yeah, Classy, that's her name. Her name is Classy? Yeah, Classy with an I and a little dick that hangs off the C which fucks the L out of the ASS. Of course, hence the tattoo. We have the name, new kid. Come on. What are you talking about? This is the worst VIP experience ever. Yeah, all I did was get farted on. You ain't going nowhere. Ha-ha, I am the ordinary stripper. I am Captain Diabetes. What? My sidekick and I simply used our powers of disguise to extract information from you. Hey, you won't get away with this, Captain Diabetes! Oh shit, my boner is weighing me down. Yeah, all I did was get farted on. Right, I'm gonna call the Better Business Bureau and tell them you only gave me half a job. The nerve of that feeling! I want to go to one of those communist countries that give out government subsidized jobs. Dance? Anyone like a dance? Last time I paid for a high-priced $20 stripper. Completely uncalled for. You have no honor. I got a chub in Thailand from a girl who had her own chub. Stop. Stop. Give up, sticky man. It's two against one now. Go on, sidekick. Kick their ass. Before the economy collapsed, you could get a chub and a pitcher's beer for $2.99. Get a chub for five bucks in Thailand. Well, that must have hurt. Surrender, super twerkers. Yeah. Maybe we can be pals after you check out of the ER. Now you're gonna get it. See the manager if you have any complaints about your lap dance experience at the Peppermint Hippo, gentlemen. Adieu. Good night out there. Be sure to tip your waitresses and maybe buy a drink for the DJ. Next up on the main stage, we've got a little bit of hot sauce coming up your way. Let's give it up for Esmeralda. That's it. The DJ calls the bitches names, and then the bitches come out of that back room. Nugent, we need to find a way to distract the DJ. I got it. Gin and tonics always make my mom pass out. If we can make one and spike it with something really strong, he'll be out for sure. Go make that drink, sidekick. One taste of that spicy snatch and you're a goner. Next up is cinnamon.
minute. You ain't the DJ. That must be her new kid. Oh shit, it's 5 0. Cops are here. After her. He went through here. He's allowed back here. Yeah, get lost. Stand aside, ladies. Captain Diabetes and his sidekick need to question that stripper. You want to get to her? You're going to have to go through us. Bring it on. All right, guys, this is your DJ back from the bathroom. Looks like we've got a special treat for you tonight. The two assholes that farted in my drink are about to get fucked in the face by our very own lovely ladies. By the power of Diabetes, I implore you to stand down, ladies. <laughs> Plan B. Here comes our favorite flower of fellatio. Give it up for Fuchsia. There. Usually that's extra. Coming through, baby. This is tiny police brutality. She comes to us straight from the Coca Cabana. You know who I mean. A big hand for our luscious Lola. Ha! Right there! Fucking you up, Miami style. Oh, hell no. I ain't getting mixed up in this combat shit. You just want to get to the far end of the room as fast as your little legs can take you there. Hope you have some fast attack. Paris! Ooh la la, need I say more yet? We can't let her get away, Sidekick! Show them what you're made of, Sidekick! Is it my turn yet? You're gonna pay if you pop one of my boots! Did it just get a lot spicier in here? Oh, that's why it's Esmeralda! Head for the end of the hallway! You gonna whoop these cops today, or what? I got my stank on that one! That's the kind of shit no match for the power of diabetes! These police is tough as shit. Oh, you little bastards done fucked up. Go get them, Bootay. Look out, ladies and gents. Here comes the queen of quippies, the mistress of BDSM, your dominatrix dream come true. It's spontaneous Bootay. Hey, honey, you ain't ready for this Bootay. I'm going to crush you in my booty cheeks. Let me sit on your face real quick. Hey. Oh my god, she's no crushing the line with her massive butt! Here comes death by spontaneous booty! Again! Oh shit! Spontaneous 
Afraid to use this thing. Come on, you kids, into the restaurant. We just gotta lift that sign. Send the sign, psychic. It is time for diabetic rage. Even my diabetic rage can't move this sign. <sighs> oh god. It's too much. I need my insulin. I need my... Oh no. Oh god, I'm out of insulin. You gotta help me, I crazy up with you, but I don't have any insulin. I'm going into diabetic shock. I'm... I'm dying. Oh god. Mom. Mom, I'm dying. Somebody, please. Please. <gasps> This is Coon checking in. How's it going for you guys? Everything cool over there? Cool. Keep me updated. You know what makes my fart super bad? Handcrafted text mix. Text mix. Not just any handcrafted text mix. It's got to be something extra special. Special. You know what to do, new kid. I, I'm alive? What happened? Who are you? Ah! Wait a minute, what happened? I thought I died from diabetes. I remember seeing a bright light, the hand of God reaching towards me. Then somebody farted in my face and I was back. I can almost still smell it. Wait. 
Wow, your thoughts can actually move objects in time. That's impressive. Now let's get back to that script. Who friends? We found a female, but she's escaped to the Italian restaurant. Requesting backup. You heard him. All coon friends to the book of the Fagagini. And I said, you know what your problem is? You're an alcoholic. <laughs> you didn't. I did. I said, I said, you can't even go a day without scotch, you lush. <laughs> I just don't get how these people can get high every night and feel... I mean, I'm sorry, but if you're sticking a cat's ass in your face, you obviously aren't happy with your marriage. <laughs> yes, I think a lot of these druggies do what they do because they're in unhappy relationships. <laughs> they probably get high because they feel trapped somehow with their spouse. That must feel horrible. <laughs> Would anyone like me to go... There they are. Where's the girl? Why don't you kids just go color on some placemats? She was just here! You didn't see her come in? Uh, no, we were busy sinking our watches. No, we were looking at menus because Cartman made us order food. Fighting crime on an empty stomach is very dangerous, human cat. It's for your own good. Whatever. She couldn't have left. We would have seen her go out the front door. Well, then maybe she's in the back. Okay, you guys check it out. Call us if you need help. We'll be waiting for you with our breadsticks. This is a past in the meatballs out to the customers. These guys look dangerous, Patrick. Antonio, get the pasta. Maybe we can do something to even the odds. with the raw with the tomatoes and the pepper and the tea. What, what is that? Ah! How dare you treat my kitchen like a reeky dink tutorial? Stand back. The real superheroes are here, Nam. Yeah, us real superheroes are here to save the day. New kid, I'm gonna do something fucking sweet. Get key. Uh, pretty sure I can fit your whole body in a stockpot, little shit. I'm gonna put boogers and cum all over. Your farts are super powerful tools to use in combat. Your new fart power can totally nullify an enemy turn. I guess we can store your corpses in the walk-in for a good six weeks. Now that's a left-handed spatula. I'm gonna violate your health code. That makes no sense! Yeah! Oh. Uh. And that really hurt. My friends are watching. I'm gonna turn you into a brachiola that make it the mouth water. <laughs> mm. This kitchen is about to heat up! You're gonna clean so many pots and pans for that? Okay, let's see what you got, new kid. Smash them, butthole! The coon will bring you dastardly chefs to justice! Wow, we're just making the pasta and the scallopini! Oh, 
Oh yeah, this one bleeds real nice. Got a beating on deck! Ah. Tell me when you've had enough! I'm gonna grill you under a brick. Hold still! Ah. That's tenderizing. I'm gonna force feed you corn and harvest your fatty liver. Ah. That ought to break down your collagens. Sorry to break up the pizza party. I'm gonna debone you, kid. I'm sending you home to Mama in the doggy bag. <sighs> oh, me, oh, Mama, I'm like a lamb to the slaughter. My balls in your sauce. No, no, not not the massage. <laughs> if they touch me again, I'm making you all bus boys. Ow. You want a cream fresh bukake with that? Gross. Fuck, I'm dripping all over the place. Ugh. I flatten you like a like a dee dee de piadina. You're about to become just another stain on my apron. We got to finish this. Tight attack. I needed that. I'm counting on you, partner. take abuse from the head chef in this kitchen. Watch and learn, newbie. The coon's on deck. The rest of you, trash bag. Thanks for standing there like a little bitch deer in the headlights. Yeah. Yeah. Well, Scott combatant, but diabetes will prevail. Uh. Uh. Captain Diabetes, prepare to strike. Chicken, no fighter like a real man. Now I pounded your noodle into the risoni. Your turn is now property of Coon and friends. Oh, I'm up. Okay. I have a really good feeling about this, guys. Like it's a sow. Your attack only fuel my rage. Prepare for a vicious squinting. Enjoy. That fucking time. You've got this, butthole. Physical damage. My favorite. This is for scrambles, you bastards! Okay, 
Okay, see you guys later. We're gonna go do some real superhero shit. Those carbohydrate crusaders were no match for the Kunin friends. Huh, sidekick? Clashy must have gone this way, but the path is barricaded. I can easily lift this out of our way, but I can't use my apple juice without insulin to bring me back down. Hmm, maybe we could trigger my diabetic rage somehow. Ugh. Wait, that's it? Your farts, psychic! Your terrible farts that throw me into fits of rage! Of course! The coon wasn't trying to make me feel insecure when he told me that my mom's farts gave me diabetes. He was trying to help me unlock my true powers! We've got to get through there and get to classy, sidekick. For the good of South Park. For Coon and friends. I need you to fart on my face. Stop, we don't be shy. I am not amused. Just tell me where to stand. Alright, ready when you are. Diabetes destruction! We did it! The path is clear. It's hard for me to lose control of myself. But if we're ever in a dire situation like that again, Psychic, know that you can fart in my face. Make sure you're stocked up on healing items and have your best artifacts equipped. That was a hell of a tip. them here, you stupid bitch? Uh-uh. Who you calling a stupid bitch? Do I look like your mama? That gang is up, Classy! These kids are cops? That ain't no cop. That's Captain Diabetes. When he was born, his mom fought it during labor and it gave him diabetes that he uses to fight crime. That is not how people get diabetes. If they aren't cops, then we can shoot them. Along with this bitch, too. Oh shit. Y'all turning on me? I knew I shouldn't have went into business with y'all Tony Soprano-looking motherfuckers. So long, Captain Diabetes. Let's see your diabetes save you now. Uh-oh. Ah, what the? I want my keys. I don't have your keys, man. Ah! Ah! Wasted on red wine. Red wine drunk is the worst drunk there is. Ah! Ah! Let's get the fuck out of here. All right, Captain. Diabetes, this is it. Give me my fucking keys. You are in no condition to drive. Then die.
You're being unreasonable, Mr. Marsh. Let me call your wife. Leave Sharon out of this, you little prick. Uh-uh, that's not fair. Y'all can't be using your ass to speed up time and skip people's turns and shit. I have a really good feeling about this, guys. This might sting. I feel no pain! Tell them what you're made of, butthole! I'm a, I'm a diabetic too, so don't hit me. Captain Diabetes does not make special arrangements for diabetic villains. Yeah. Yeah. Oh shit, that looked like it hurt. Oh, I'm up? Okay. Never fear, I'm here. Hey, hey. Shit, shit, hang on, Sharon's texting me. I can't type. Why the fuck can't I type? Why are my thumbs so big? Hey Siri, fucking take a note and tell my wife to fuck off because I'm fighting. Poop emoji. <laughs> my keys. Yeah, give it up, you and your tiny pews. I think we underestimated the power of red wine. <laughs> ah, damn, they got you all weak and shit. You better not lose, nigga. Oh man, she sounds pissed. Which one of you assholes told Sherrod I was here? Hold on, hold on. Be home soon. Looking for my fucking keys. Heart, heart, XO. Holy fuck, what did you guys do to rage him out so bad? 
Like a... choices. Alright, I'm gonna take a cab. There! Nobody drinks and drives on Captain Diabetes' watch. Aight, aight, shit. Look, all I know is there's a kingpin trying to get new high-grade drugs out on the street. It's somebody trying to bring the Italians and Chinese crime families together and shit. Enough small talk. Where is Scrambles? Scrambles? We need this reward money for our superhero franchise. Oh, shit. Y'all just want a cat? So then there's Cisco. He just some low-class asshole start working two months ago. He be talking all this shit about making money off the crime in the city because some big shot white boy be running all the drugs and all the hookers and shit, right? Okay. Uh-uh, but not me. I'm my own pimp, you know what I'm saying? It's like I got one investment in this world, and that's my pussy, and I ain't putting no mortgage on that to some high-paying nigga talking about trying to make more money off crime and shit. Classy, classy, I'm sorry, but what what about the cats? Oh, that cats? Okay, that's this little Asian freak named Yakibaba or some shit like that. He going around paying all these little sixth graders to take people's cats. That's fucked up. I think taking that pussy and, like, taking mine, you know what I'm saying? That's like criminal shit. Where do the cats go? I can tell you, but I ain't saying shit until I know I'm safe, you understand? These niggas ain't playing, and I need to know you gonna protect my ass. Eric Cartman, do you have any idea what time it is? This is a school night. Mom, not now. We're seriously onto something. You kids all get home now, or I'm calling your parents. Sorry, Mrs. Cartman. Please don't tell my mom. And who is this stripper woman? These cone friends offer me protection. Well, she's not staying here. Fine, fast pass, take her to your house. Okay. And now, the news program that starts your day off right. Good morning, South Park. Good morning, South Park. A new vigilante took to the streets last night and has apparently single-handedly taken down the Famboni crime family. Here with more is a midget in a bikini. Tom, I'm standing outside the Boca de Fagaccini where the vigilante declared war on crime in South Park. Security camera footage showed a young person farting in people's faces on their balls. It was just terrifying. The kid came in and just, just started farting on people. It was out of nowhere, man. Maybe someone's finally standing up to what's wrong with this city. This new kid's a hero. The kid's a menace, if you ask me. How long before he or she kills an innocent person? How long before Daredevil becomes the Punisher? Huh? Three seasons? Three seasons! Police called to the scene found a treasure trove of illegal items that they claim might tie the Italian restaurant to a larger crime syndicate. This may be just the tip of the iceberg. Certainly chilling stuff, and there are reports the vigilante possibly had a sidekick? There was thought to be a sidekick, Tom, but further investigation showed it was just some little twerp with diabetes. Thanks, Midget, and of course, the question on everyone's minds now, who is the farting vigilante? This is going to make us look bad. You fucked up. It wasn't our fault. This kid just came into the restaurant and started farting like there was no tomorrow. All you Italians are supposed to do is move the product. The Chinese and Russians do the rest. Everything has to be discreet and quiet or people are gonna learn the truth. That we put the product into people's drugs and alcohol in order to create more crime. You just keep doing your part in getting the cheese out on the streets. Or maybe I'll start dealing directly with the Russians. Or the Chinese. Or the sixth graders. Oh, man. 
Man, what a great sleep. Yeah, I haven't slept that well in weeks. <sighs> so, you guys do anything interesting last night? Oh, no, you know, the usual. Just watched some TV and went to bed. Yep, nothing exciting in our b boring lives. Well then, I guess I'll just be seeing you guys tomorrow. You've got a big day ahead of you, new kid. Get changed into your superhero costume and wait for a message from the king. How do you do that? That was dumb.